I got my ass kicked in the stock market crash of 2008. The funny thing was, it came on the heels of this great couple of years that I had had. I bought this stock called First Solar, and it was the darling of Wall Street, and it went way up, and I made all this money, and I was thinking I was the king of the universe, right? And uh, the problem was, I gave it all back in 2008. I lost hundreds of thousands of dollars. It was a horrible experience. What always happens when you have a horrible experience, sometimes good things come out of it. I'll tell you about those good things in a minute. But what it made me do is it made me sit down and come up with a plan. Because I said, never again do I want to be in this situation where the market or the stock or both takes me out, right? I never want to be in a situation where I'm crushed. I sat down and I made a plan. Turns out it was a three-year plan. And I said, okay, I'm going to make a plan so that this never happens to me again. And I'm not going to do it by going to cash. I'm going to do it with a, a really solid investing system. You see, I had a lot of knowledge of investing systems. I've had a brokerage firm. I've traded $14 billion worth of securities. I just didn't have a system for creating income and a system that would protect me in all markets. So I sat down and I devised a plan. And the first step was, whenever you devise a plan, whenever anybody is successful in doing anything in life, they look around and go, okay, who's done this before? And that's what I did. I looked around and I, I used a program called modeling. And my brain runs this program and says, who can I model? Who can I find? But what gurus have done this before? And I went and I invested in those gurus. I went and invested in their programs. I went around the world and I took seminars and I went to courses and I bought materials and I invested in myself. I started investing thousands and then hundreds of thousands and then millions of dollars in the market going up and down. And I figured out at the end of this, the solution. And I'm gonna tell you about that solution in just a little bit, but all of it came from that really badass kicking that I had in 2008 crash. I'm gonna tease you with this printout from Charles Schwab of my IRA. You can see that, I'll talk about that in just a second. And then the ultimate thing here is that we all create a portfolio that makes us 10,000, 20,000, or even $30,000 a month. So we don't have to be a slave to our job so we can create the freedom that we want in our lives. The problem is probably right now, the market is really high. And if it's really high, are you making the most amount of money that you could be, right? Because this is a time to make money when the market's at highs. Now, on the other side, if the market's low or going lower, are you protecting yourself? Maybe even, are you still making money in those markets? The answer is probably no to both of those. And the third one is the, is the real problem. And that is people don't know how to invest for steady income, income that can replace their primary job. That's the goal, right? Is to create a steady cash flowing income. Now, I wanna tell you about Wall Street because I used to be a Wall Street guy and I had a Wall Street firm and a brokerage firm and all that kind of stuff. And I want you to know, it ain't all what you think. Wall Street is run by salespeople and lawyers. That's what I've discovered. Their job is to gather your money, right? That's the salesperson's job, gather your money and then hold on to your money. The lawyers tell them the best way to hold on to people's money is to not let them leave, get them an average return. That will prevent them from suing us. And how do you prevent them from suing? You get them an average return so that when you go to the judge and you go, your honor, I got 8% and that's what everybody else in the market got. So you guys gonna go get the heck out of here. So their goal is to be really, really diversified and safe and average. But salespeople got to get paid. I have no problem with financial advisors and brokerage guys getting paid. I have no problem with that. People need to get paid, but they got to provide value. Now, Tony Robbins wrote a book called Money, Master the Game a few years ago. And in his research, he discovered that about 3.4% off the top comes out of the investor to pay for these salespeople and the people that run the funds and all that kind of stuff. That's a lot of money. I've done the graph on that and it's ridiculous. The graph goes like this. You spend a lot of money to have people running your account. They better be doing an awesome job. They don't have a system. They got all these fancy degrees, chartered financial analysts and financial planner and financial advisor, financial consultant, all these kinds of things. But at the end of the day, they don't really have a system. Their system is diversification, which basically costs you money. Here's the way I look at it. Let's say you're in a lousy relationship with somebody. When the one comes, you're already taken. You're, you're not gonna get out of this relationship to go to the new one like that. And so you're gonna miss those opportunities. That's the problem with diversification, is your money's already allocated into this muddied average thing, and then you miss out on the big opportunities that don't come along every single day. These big brokerage firms, they don't have an edge. At least for you, they don't have the edge. Their only edge is to keep you invested. And if you stay invested long enough, the dollar will be devalued 
far enough such that the account goes up. When you devalue the denominator in an equation, the numerator's value goes up. And so what you're seeing when these markets have these returns is not that everything is great, what you're seeing is a hedge for inflation. And so if they can keep you invested long enough, your account goes up. It doesn't really go up, the value is still the same. It's just that you think it goes up. That's why houses are going up and cars are going up in price and stocks are going up in price and the stock market's at all time highs or whatever, right? It's because the denominator is continuing to go down and get devalued, which makes the numerator go higher. So that's their edge. I'm Mark Yegi. You probably want to know who you're listening to. Um, I've got 40 years of investing on Wall Street. I ran a Wall Street firm. I've traded billions of dollars worth of stock. I've written a bunch of books on money and a bunch of other books. Basically, I travel the world now and I help people learn about not just money, but how to live better lives. I run a couple of income funds that utilizes exactly what I'm going to be talking about here in a few minutes. And I've had all the licenses and registered investment advisor. I've had all that kind of stuff. And maybe too many of those things. But here's the important thing about all that is that I've taken all that and I put it into a system that allows me to live the life that I want to live. So I get to travel around the world. My goal is to go to 100 countries. I'm sitting here in Thailand right now, country number 64. And my goal is to go to another bunch of countries so that I can experience new people and new things and adventure before my hips give out and my knees don't work anymore, right? That's what I want. That's, that's financial freedom for me. I don't know what it is for you. Everybody has their own definition. But for me, I'm living the ideal life that I want to live. For me, I've designed my life around five freedoms. Financial freedom, which drives all the other ones, right? If you have enough money, you can do whatever you want if you know, you're not crazy. But I also have time freedom. I don't have to go to a job. I don't have to go to somebody else's schedule. I can live anywhere out in the world that I want, so I have location freedom. I have the freedom to pursue my purpose. My purpose is to help as many people get a better life going for themselves. And that's, that's what I, I love doing, and that's the joy that I find. And then I get to hang out with the people that I wanna hang out. I don't have to hang out with people that I work with because I work with them, or family members because they're my family. I get to hang out with the people that I choose. I was putting together kind of the returns for what happened in 2023, you know, just doing some year-end research. And I noticed that the S&P 500 had a good year. Now, on January 9th of 2023, I made a call that we were going into a bull market. And at that time, everybody was like, no, we're going to have a recession. The market, the Fed's going to do this. And they had all these excuses. So it was a really hard time to listen to me make that call. But I made the call on January 9th, and we have been in a bull market this year. The S&P 500 has gone up 24% year to date. But the average of the top 12 stocks, and I have those right there on your screen, the top 12 stocks is 145%. So the S&P is 24, but the average is 145 of those top 12 stocks. And you know the stocks, NVIDIA, Facebook, Accenture, Royal Caribbean Cruises, uh, Uber, Carnival, Palo Alto Networks, Tesla, which is a big one for me, Salesforce, you know these big companies, and they really outperformed this year. If you can find what I call a super stock, you get some major outperformance in your portfolio. And I can show you how to find super stocks. Not always right, but I can pretty much show you the consistent things that most super stocks have done over the last 120 years. This is the 10 year result of these stocks. This first one is Tesla. And so to going back 10 years, you can see that Tesla made 2,420% or 242% a year for 10 years versus the S&P made 15.4%. So 15 versus 242, Tesla did way better. Nvidia did even better. Nvidia is up 1,208% per year. Meta, which is Facebook, Instagram and WhatsApp, they're up 54% a year, even with that big crash that they had in the bear market of 2022. Apple, 86% a year versus 15.4% for the S&P 500. Amazon, up 67%. Per year, up 670% for 10 years. To me, it tells me something. It tells me that Wall Street hates you and they hate us. Because if they didn't hate us, they would be putting, in this, putting us in these really good investments. But instead, they're probably keeping them for themselves. And they put us into these average investments. I don't know about you, but I don't wake up every day going, I want to be average. So I want to tell you about this IRA thing. A few years ago, I was challenged by this jerk in my life that uh, didn't believe that I was putting out the returns that I was getting. So I had a few years where I was really on a run. I made 44%, then 77%, then 126%. Then I had a year where I lost 6%. Anyway, he looked at these returns. He was like, there's no way you're doing that. And I'm like, well, they're in the account. But it also gave me like a, a wake up call. 
And the wake up call was, am I really committing to my investment program that I developed way back in 2008 through 2011? Am I committing to that? Or am I just dabbling? And I realized that I was dabbling a little bit here and there. I decided to take this IRA that I had, which only had a couple hundred shares of this Twitter stock in it at the time when it was trading. And I sold the Twitter stock and I said, this account is gonna be for my cash flow machine program that I've developed only. And so I went all in on this program. Because remember, I didn't want to ever have that situation before where I was losing money, but I still hadn't really committed in my mind. And so I went all in in 2020 here in this account, put 111,822, and I've done only cash flow machine, the methodology I'm about to talk to you about, and I'll show you the results. At the end of April of 2020, I had invested in Netflix, and after three and a half months, I got a signal that Netflix wasn't the right one, and that I should go into Tesla. So I've been in Tesla ever since. So it's been about three and a half years. So you can see on the screen here, May of 2020 to December, Christmas Eve of 2023, that's about three years and eight months or something like that, and you can see the returns. It started with 111,822. You can see there's no net contributions during that whole three and a half year period. The investment changes, the account has gone up 511,000 and it's now sitting on Christmas Eve on 2023 of 623,000. I don't know about you, but I think that's pretty darn good. And it's only been in Tesla in this cash flow machine program, which I'm gonna tell you about. Go to the right side where we have that little graph there and you can see it's been a volatile ride, no question. But would you rather have the volatility and at the end of the volatility be up $500,000 on $111,000 invested? Or would you rather have this nice smooth little chart at the bottom, which is the S&P 500? Some people want the smooth one. If you could handle a stock with volatility, and there's, there's a happy medium in here, by the way. I just happen to be in the Tesla one because I really believe in the company. And that's the result. And I fully believe in another five years, it's gonna be way higher, but anyway. So the point here is, that you've got to have a proven income system. That's what this is built on. And that's the lesson that I learned. If you don't have a proven income system, you're doomed to fail. And so remember how I told you I learned that lesson from earlier? I put that whole program together from those lessons that I learned in 2008. Well, what really came from that is this system that I call the cash flow machine. And it basically tells me that every trader needs a system. And a system is something that because money is emotionally charged, a system reduces emotions. I don't know about you, but when I have high emotions, I have lousy decisions. And so emotions go up, intelligence goes down and vice versa. So our goal is to reduce those emotions. How do we do that? Well, we create a system with rules and tactics and strategies and certainty. And what if scenarios like what if the market goes down or what if the stock goes down? We also have an edge. Our edge is that we try to get the probabilities in our favor. Right? We try to take it from a 50-50 probability to something a little bit higher. And so that's what the proven system that I've developed is. I'll tell you about that in a second. But here's what a system will do for you. A system will basically lower the guesswork. It'll lessen the emotions. It'll increase the probabilities for being right. It'll give you that edge. It will find, in our system, we find super stocks, right? So that we have the we have the edge in our favor. We have the market moving in our favor. We have the stock moving in our favor. We take advantage of the gambler. We do that by doing a system of covered calls and being the writer, the seller of the calls, just like Warren Buffett does. And if we can do all that, we get the odds stacked in our favor. If you don't know anything about covered calls, I put together this little animation that uses kind of a cool analogy to explain what covered calls are. If you're an expert in covered calls, you can fast forward three minutes and 12 seconds past this little animation, and you won't have to sit through this little primer about what covered calls are. But if you don't understand them, or if you don't understand them well enough to follow along with me for the rest, just watch this three minute video, it's kind of cool. So here's a guy named Jim, the guy with the red tie here, and he owns some land. Let's call it a city block, and it's worth about $100,000. Then there is Bob, this guy with the red hair and the beard, and he sees this lot is for sale, and he hears that a big hotel is going up right across the street from that land. So he thinks that that land could be worth maybe $200,000, not just $100,000. But the problem is, he doesn't have $100,000 to buy it. He's kind of broke, 
but he sees this big opportunity there. What he does is he approaches Jim and he says, I'll pay you $10,000 if you'll sell me your property anytime in the next six months for your asking price of $100,000. Jim says, wait a minute, if I sell you my property for the same price I want to sell it for now, but the only difference is you're going to pay me $10,000 to take it off the market and give you a chance to buy it anytime in the next six months and I get to keep the $10,000? And Bob says, yeah, that's what I'm offering. So they shake hands and they make a deal. So, who has the risk here? Well, looking at Bob, he could lose his full $10,000 if he's wrong. Now, if he's right, he hits a home run. Okay, now Jim, his deal is he gets to keep the $10,000 no matter what. It goes right into his wallet, and if Bob exercises his option, Jim also sells his lot for the asking price that he wanted. He gets his $100,000 too. So Jim, in this case, has a relatively low risk. Make sense? A week later, Bob finds out that it was just a rumor and this hotel is not going up and it's not going to make that property worth $200,000. And Jim still has a piece of property that's worth $100,000. Nothing's changed on his side. Let's analyze the positions. Jim still owns the lot and he got a $10,000 bonus or a 10% return. He also reduced his cost, he reduced his risk. That's another way to look at it. Bob, on the other hand, got unlucky. He invested his $10,000 and he lost all of it, so he was really unlucky. In this case, Jim basically just collected rent from Bob on his property. So over time, I would ask you this, who would you rather be? Would you rather be Jim that has the lot or would you rather be Bob that you know was swinging for the fences but he lost it all? Well, that's an easy one. You want to be like Jim. You want to be the guy that doesn't take the huge risk. Now, can we be Jim in the stock market? Well, you better believe it. And if you've ever played Monopoly, it has a couple of places on the board. Boardwalk and Park Places are the most expensive properties on the board. But if you own any properties on the board, any time somebody lands on them, they have to pay you rent every time they go around the board. So there's always a Bob out there. There's always a gambler out there that's willing to pay you rent. And if you're Jim, you could take money from all the Bobs over and over and over again, all year long. And that's what we want to do. We want to start collecting rent. So we want to be like Jim. We want to be the option seller. We want to be the person collecting the rent. This chart that I'm showing you right here in front of you is a chart that I show my investors all the time. It's the option value over time. It's the time decay. It basically shows as time goes forward, an option loses its value. Well, if you own something that loses its value going forward, you're losing money. But if you've already sold something that's losing value, you're gaining money. So you want to be the, on the other side of the trade. So I have them burn this chart into their brain. Now this chart works for hours, days, months, weeks, minutes, whatever. That's the way the chart looks. It kind of dives right before it's about to expire and accelerates in decline. But you want to be on the other side of that. You don't want to be the buyer, you want to be the seller. So in my program called the Cash Flow Machine, we have developed a system around four cornerstones. It's to buy the right stock in the right market at the right spot on the chart, and then we squeeze the juice, we collect the rent. And I'm, and I'm gonna round these off, but based on some research that I have, if you choose the right stock, and this is the biggest question I get at cocktail parties, hey Mark, this is the stock I'm buying. Okay, great, that's important. If you choose the right stock, you go from a 50% chance of being right when you click the mouse to buy a stock, and the other person's got a 50% chance of being right too, to inching the probabilities in your favor. The right stock gives you about a five to 7% edge on top of the 50%. So now you're up to 55 to 57%. If you're in the right market, like Warren Buffett says, you want to be paddling with the stream. I use it as a sailing analogy. I want to be uh, have a tailwind so that I'm sailing away from the wind and not into the wind. I want to be sailing away from the wind with a tailwind. It's a lot easier that way. And that gives you another five to 7% edge because it's a market of stocks, a stock market. And a stock has about a 70% chance of correlating to the market in general. So you get an edge just by being in the right market. Then we look for the right spot on the chart. And this is some methodology that I learned from William O'Neill is that you want to be in stocks that are breaking out, they have momentum to the upside. That gives you another five to 7% percent 
edge because 40% of all breakouts fail, 60% succeed if they're the right breakout at the right spot on the chart. And then finally, we squeeze the juice, we collect the rent. Now, I don't have a statistic on this because we always get the rent. It's just, I believe it's about a five to 6% edge that you get for this. So if you add all the edges I gave you, you get about a 70 to 77% chance of being right, a probability of 70 to 77%. I don't know about you, but I'll take 70 to 77% over 50% any day of the week. Plus we always collect the income just like Jim. Here is uh, David King. He's now become a really good friend of mine. He's been in our program for about six years and he made this uh, testimonial a couple years ago. Uh, take a look and see what David has to say. I got involved with Mark's system two years ago this month. My first year was quite a learning experience. I had great successes. Equally, I had great failures. But in 2019, I made 40.6% on my money, which is unheard of for someone with a high school education and no experience trading whatsoever. This system is off the charts. If you listen to Mark, he'll make you rich. And David just finished up a, a year where he made about 54%. He's doing really well with the system. He loves it. He sleeps well at night and uh, it's the kind of stuff that we're doing. Why do you need a proven system? Well, to show you why you need a proven system, I have to take this goal that we have of making two to 4% a month, which sounds small, and I have to show you the power of the goal by using time as our ally. And so I have this little section called financial porn, and that's where I just play with numbers. Now I can't play with your numbers and everybody's numbers. I can only play with a couple of numbers just to give you an example. But let's say you took $100,000 today and you invested it at 2% a month. Now remember, our goal is to make two to four percent a month. You invested at 2% a month and you did it for 10 years. You would have at the end of 10 years, a million 76,000, which is about a 10 X on your investment. But if you got 4%, now you're talking about your hundred thousand dollars becoming worth 11 million. Okay. In just 10 years. So that's the power of compounding when you compound it with the right rate. Not when you're just getting average returns, we have to wait 30 years but you're getting some meaningful FU money going on, right? And that's what I'm going for. Is I don't think I'm taking outlandish risks. I think I'm collecting income, which lowers my risk actually. I'm going into good stocks. And these are the kind of returns that I fully am expecting to get. And I have gotten in some cases, okay? Just not in that IRA yet, it's only three and a half years old. So the bottom line is that small wins add up to big gains over time. So what are the three keys to my proven system for creating income? Well, I've explained them to you already, but let me boil them down to this summary. I use options. Options give me income, which is coming from the rent, the juice, we call it, right? Probabilities, probabilities hedge the risks, right? They bring in income, which lowers your basis so that you're not so exposed. Number three is we compound those returns. I just showed you the numbers of what can happen when you compound your returns. So who uses this strategy? Who the heck is doing this? Well, the big money institutions are doing it because it's free money. Citigroup, Bank of America, all those big firms that trade all those billions of dollars every day. I want to follow those guys. If they're going into a stock, I want to be in that stock. If they're selling a stock, I don't want to be in it. I want to sell it. So I skate to where the puck is going to be, not where it's been, says Wayne Gretzky, right? And he was right. So I want to follow the big money institutions because they know where the puck is going to be. Who else uses it? Warren Buffett uses it. He's produced a lot of his wealth using options. He just doesn't talk about it. Now, a lot of people like my friend, so-called friend a few years ago says, you know, this is too good to be true. I've taught hundreds of people now in this program how to do this. And that's what I love to do is I love to see people's eyes open and as they learn something new. And here are some testimonials from texts that I got. I'm not going to read you everything. I got, I got hundreds of texts, but uh, I put up a smattering of them here. Here's one from Eddie, who's a, a doctor in our program. But Be between my Roth IRA and my wife's, we have 430,000. I'm well on my way to my $500,000 year. Maybe I should shoot for 600,000 by the end of the, the year. Even though, even through January 22, with Tesla's drop, I was able to gain 15%. 160,000 to 184. This is a Roth IRA, so I only added 6,000 in the middle of January. I don't need to read all of it, but he's shooting for 40 to 50% in one account and 100% in the other account. He's up 71.83%. Uh, he's up 123,528, all paid for by the juice. Isn't this amazing? 
And then this letter from Joe that I got. Mark, I wanted to send you a personal note. I'm such a believer in the system and so grateful to be a part of it. End phase has been getting crushed, but as you've said, it's just math and it's about the big picture. Right now, the S&P 500 is break even to slightly down and end phase is down almost 20% from my entry point at 292, but I'm up 3%. Plus the knowledge I've learned and what my trading plan is looking like moving forward is priceless. In the seventh worst year since 27, for the S&P 500, you've made a believer in me. So there's lots of other people that are getting some results here. One of those people is one of our earliest people, and that is Lori. And uh, let you, I'll just let you hear Lori and what she has to say. I'm Lori. Um, nice to meet everybody. Um, it's very exciting to be here. I'm, I'm so excited for all of you because like, I'm blown away by what's happening with my money. <laughs> I'm like pinching myself every, every day and every week when I look at my account. You're not going to believe it. Um, so Mark and I met in, in um, our building and on the pool deck <laughs> and, and um, I started with him in, in March. We, he, he, we started out where he placed a trade for me and within two days I made $6,500 on 200000 I'm like, whoa. <laughs> so he kind of started with that and then I started in the program because he was setting this up in, um, in May. May 16th, I started with 400000 and I'm now at 475000 so it's like incredible income that just keeps coming in. And I'm like, wow, this is amazing that this is happening. So I'm very excited for all of you to, to start in this as well. And whoever else can get in it, because this is what we all want is financial freedom, right? So we can do the things we love to do. Trust the system and trust that Mark knows what he's doing, which he does. I have full confidence in that. Totally. Like you guys are... Trust me, you're in the right hands. This is like incredible, <laughs> really. You're just gonna be, as you're gonna see as it goes on that you're just, your mind is gonna be blown and you're gonna be like, what planet am I living on now that I can do this so easily? My goal is to make this so that you can't say no, right? Because I wanna help you. I wanna help a lot of people. I have a big goal, a BHAG as they're called, big, hairy, audacious goal to help a ton of people before I die. And uh, I can't think of a better way to help people than to help them with their finances. And I really believe in this program. It's the best thing I've ever seen on Wall Street. Fortunately, I got to create it. So, um, and I've never seen anything like it. So the cash flow machine system is the solution and it's got rules and strategies and tactics. It helps you build a trading plan. It helps you target two to 4% a month. It only takes you about 20 minutes to an hour a week. It performs well in all markets. It reduces your risk in down markets. It makes income 100% of the time. You're always collecting the income because you're always selling options. And it's a probability-based system. Now, the cool thing about this, at least for me, is you can do it from anywhere. I do it from my laptop and my phone, from anywhere I am in the world. I just need an internet connection. You can ditch your nine to five if that's something that you wanna do. You can be completely independent. And I'm looking for some people that get it. Like, you, you kinda got a flavor of what I do. You saw some results. You saw some other people with results. Like, you either get it or you don't. If you get it, you're one of my peeps, right? You wanna make money in every type of the market. You might wanna create income and cash flow weekly or monthly so you can live on it. You don't wanna spend time day trading and being glued to a computer. Like, you get it. It's for you if you wanna create income from your investments of two to 4% a month. It could be for you if you're a person that's trading your time for money. So anybody who doesn't wanna spend time in front of the computer, this could be for them. Anybody who's open to learning if you're open to learning and a new way of thinking and investing, this will rewire your brain to think a little bit differently. If you're willing to understand that investing is playing defense as well as offense, if you're okay with not trying to hit a home run, the people in the Hall of Fame are the people that get on base. They're not the people that are swinging for the home runs. A couple of them are, but most of them are hitting singles. By the way, this is not for everybody. So if you're one of those people that is looking for a get rich quick team, you wanna be an option buyer. I want you to be taking the risk because I'm going to take the other side of that. So that's what the get rich quick person does is they're the option buyer. If you're that person, do not get involved with us. It's not for you. If you're trying to kill it, like if you want to put $100,000 in today and have it turn into $200,000 next week, don't even bother. This is not a get rich quick thing. This is not a kill it, hit it out of the park kind of thing. If you're not willing to stick to a proven system, and this is a big deal. If you don't have the discipline to stick to a proven system, if you want to just keep trying stuff because it's exciting 
or you heard Kramer talk about it and you want to try this, this is not for you. This is a proven system that's frankly quite boring and you've got to stick to it. You've got to just do it week in and week out. You're, you're seeing the results that I'm putting on the screen. Anybody who needs a lot of stimulation in your investing, because again, it's boring. If you need to be in 10 different stocks, this is not for you, right? If you don't have a long-term mindset, if you're in something and it goes down and you're like, I'm out, right? And I've seen that happen. This isn't for you. Like you have to have a long-term plan. Like we're going for that spot 10 years from now. And the way we're gonna get there is we're gonna execute our plan day by day, week by week, month by month, until we get to that freaking spot. If you're not one of those people that has a long-term mindset, don't bother. This is not for you. I, you know, save us the time and the money. Save yourself the time and the money. But if it is for you, I want to tell you about this program. And I have, it's all around this system called the cash flow machine. Okay, that's our methodology. I showed you the cornerstones a minute ago, but we have a methodology. And our main course is our fast launch course. We call it the fast launch because some people want to just get up and running really fast. We want you to launch into it really fast. So it's called our fast launch course. What does it cover? It starts with understanding options. It helps people that don't understand anything. If you're intermediate, great, because it'll help you with that too. But if you don't understand anything, don't worry, we got you covered. Understanding options, setting up your account, doing covered calls, learning the basics of the system, doing trade adjustments for when the things go against you, because they will, market timing, selecting the right stock, we're looking for those super stocks, being in the right market and how to handle the right market, how to know when you're in the right market, fundamental screening so you can find those super stocks, the right spot on the chart, that's pattern recognition, choosing the right option, your trading plan, which we spend a lot of time building your trading plan, it's a critical component to mindset, crossover strategies, roll ups, roll downs, examples, explanations, and then we start to control your emotions because you're gonna get emotional, it's gonna happen. You need to make sure you're sticking to your trading plan to reduce those emotions. And then all of this leads to this mindset management thing. And mindset to me is 90% of all trading. So if you can manage the mind by using a trading plan, by using all the certainty that we give you, then you can figure out the right way to be involved in your, with your money, right? And your returns. So that's what we cover in the program. So here's what you're gonna get. If you enroll in our program, you're gonna get our super stock analysis system, which basically takes all the 11 things that we've discovered and boils them down into you know, some things that you can quickly apply so that you can find those super stocks for yourself. I sell that program separately called the Stock Trade Genius University. It's about a $3,000 course. I'm boiling it down and giving you that program in here, okay? I'm giving you my genius market timing system, which I've, it took me 10 years to develop and it's right about 75, 80% of the time. And I'm giving that to you. I'm not just gonna show, tell you if the market's going up or down. I'm gonna show you how to build it into your system. It took about $700,000 in experience and experiments to get to this level. I think it's worth about two grand, probably worth way more than that, but let's just put a number on it and say it's worth about $2,000. With one trade, it's worth that. Right? Pattern recognition chart book, so you can start to get your brain used to these patterns. Now, Investor's Business Daily has these things they put out every year, uh, model stocks or something like that. It's a thousand bucks a year for this book. I've been putting this together for a long time and I'm updating it now. I'll throw that in. It's just about a $997 per year value. Let's just call it a thousand dollars. I developed a calculator that helps you do compare apples to oranges. And then I have a bonus that I'll give you, and that's a, uh, a cash flow machine golden rules that you can print out, laminate, put them up on your wall, whatever you wanna do. So you always have those rules in front of you to help you keep those emotions in check. You add all that stuff up together, it's at least worth 6,500 bucks, okay? I'm obviously not gonna charge $6,500 because I wanna get a lot of people involved, so I'm trying to figure out a way to make this so that I can get the most amount of people involved in this. Maybe it's you, I hope it's you if you're still watching. So I'm gonna bring that down to $1,997. But I believe in the program so much because you don't know me yet, I don't think, and I don't know you, but I know, I know the results that I get and I know the program. So I feel really confident to be able to give you this. And that is a 60 day money back guarantee. Here's the deal. If you take the course and you follow what we talk about in the course, and you do your first trade, you'll probably do your first trade in the first couple of weeks and you start trading, you start implementing the, the rules and the tools that we give you in the system, and you don't make back at least half your money in 60 days of what you invest in the program, send me an email, 
put it in your calendar and say, I'm gonna send an email for 60 days from now and get my money back. If you haven't made half your money back on the investment from the course, I'll give you your whole investment back, your whole enrollment fee. Cool? That's how much I believe in this program. Guess what? I've never had to give anybody their money back. Never. I'm really proud of that. Don't be the first, by the way. Okay? Do what the program says, and I guarantee, with the 60-day money back guarantee, that you won't have to ask for your money back. But I saved the best for last. And that is, I want to give you an even bigger discount, an even bigger reason to get involved. And I'm only going to do this for a few people. But I created something that my team is hating on me right now for, and that is, I created something called the Big Coupon. So if you're watching this right now, you might be on YouTube or something like that. Or if you're not on YouTube, below this video, there's probably a link that you can go and enroll in this program right now. But above that little enrollment link, I put something that says Big Coupon. If it's not there, it's not available anymore. You could still get the program for $19.97. But if it's there, I'm giving you a discount. And this is a one-time only kind of discount until they're gone. Because when they're gone, they're gone. But if it's in the bottom and it says big coupon, there's going to be a code next to it and an amount for the coupon, which I'm not going to tell you what it is. You have to go down to find it. The amount for the coupon, you put in the code, copy it right down the code or copy it, and then go to that enrollment link right now, enroll in the program, put in the coupon code, get that discount, and then you can be immediately enrolled and start taking the videos. On top of the 1997, if this is still available, that is, you can get this big coupon and get an even bigger discount on this program. So what are the next steps? Next steps, first of all, click on the link below to enroll, use the coupon code if it's there, the big coupon, begin watching the videos, start making income, period, end of story. So that's it, I hope, uh, your time invested in this has been worth it. I sure thank you for your time because I know it's hard to sit through a 45 minute webinar or whatever, but I, hopefully it was worth your time and I hope I get to meet you on the inside of the program or down the road at one of my events or both. But until then, never give up your power in your health, your wealth, or your time. Thanks for showing up. See you later.